Vikings. Right now on EasyCanada.com. It's Gautier versus George Lucas and a new parody, The Star Wars That I Used to Know. Nick Offerman reads young female celebrity tweets, and Joe Manganiello strips down his Magic Mike character. Log on now to etcanada.com. First time in over a decade, Corey Hart will perform in Canada. He's taking the stage at Toronto's Gay Pride festivities this weekend. But is he ready to be back in the spotlight? What are you feeling right now? Well, I'm nervous about how I'm going to be. I'm got my first rehearsal is tonight. Yeah, and uh, I haven't. You know, shit, I hope it's like riding a bike, you know? <laughs> Corey's still deciding what he's actually going to sing on Saturday, but he can confirm that he will not be bringing back his spiky hair. I think that, that a guy that just turned 50 uh, a month ago, yeah. um, it is inappropriate <laughs> to wear spikes. <laughs> Like, I'm begging you right now. Oh, man. Like, I'm begging you right now. Oh, maybe I'll put a few up for you. One thing is for sure, Corey will perform a never-released single from his 1988 album, Young Man Running. The song, called The Truth Will Set You Free, has been revamped and re-recorded, but it maintains its original significance. Three very close friends of mine uh, that were gay yeah. and that were struggling with their sexuality and their acceptance. Uh, and I saw a lot of pain, and it affected me. It affected me a lot, and so I wrote the song. 